Hey guys, it's Monday and uh, I'm going downstairs again for my cappuccino. Loving this part of my routine, really. And um, I'm taking coconut uh, milk with me. I wanna, I wanna ask barista to make my cappuccino with coconut milk because um, I wanna try to cut on dairy a little bit. So we'll see. The milk thickened in the fridge, so today my cappuccino is made of the regular dairy milk. Today I took a notebook with me and uh, I want to script a, a video that I would like to make. It's about um, how to survive unmedicated birth. Uh, I don't think that it suits well to my channel, but. Uh, after thinking about it for a long time, I I think that it's an important topic and uh, I do have uh, something to say. So um, I think uh, I will make a video and um, we'll see how it goes and we'll see if uh, somebody uh, finds it useful. I'm having lunch, I'm having a uh, herring with uh, onions and dry bread and honestly guys this is one of my favorite food of all times. <laughs> I just love herring and love all the meals that um, claim for uh, call for herring. I will eat it. Baby nap was so short today, it was like just one hour or even less than one hour and he always wanted me to lie with him so I haven't had a chance to do anything while he was asleep and he probably won't go down for another nap today so lately this has been the favorite baby activity tearing toilet paper once I put a new roll of toilet paper to the bathroom the baby takes it and tears it apart immediately. And this is like all over my house. I know it's good for baby brain, so I'm not mad. I'm making mashed potatoes with broccoli for me and uh, for the baby. Well, mostly for the baby. And it also goes very, very well with herring. Hey guys, today is uh, 9th of March and uh, today is my son's first birthday, yay! I even did my hair, look. I'm gonna do my makeup later in the day and um, will be beautiful for my son. Okay you guys, so quick update. Uh, yesterday was 8th of March, it's an International Women's Day. I don't really know how international it really is. Um, do you guys celebrate it in the US? Because uh, here especially, um, especially all the um, post-Soviet countries uh, will like celebrate it strictly and uh, all uh, men um, give their women 
like their mothers and their wives and their girlfriends presents and flowers and uh, everything and um, you know people have different different opinions on it these days but I personally really really like it I think that uh, there's no bad thing in having an extra day in the year when your uh, loved one uh, will give you extra attention like flowers presents uh, express his love and affection and everything he uh, everything you mean to me so I really love it and I really enjoy it and uh, I don't I don't see any like uh, shadow of the Soviet epoch here or anything bad so let me know do you celebrate this uh, this day and uh, what it means to you or what does it mean in your country I will I will I'm really interested uh, about it so it's time to say goodbye for today me and my huge brows are uh, wishing you a great day and good week and uh, we'll see you next time thanks for watching bye bye and take care